Good morning, everybody. We got off to a little bit of a late start. It was a late night last night. Uh, so um, Joe and I finally got here to the show and thanks everybody for posting your suggestions because I wanna make this day um, what you wanna see. So I'm getting some really good ideas and I'm over here at the Milky's Mom's booth with two of my favorite ladies. Um, we are oldie but goodie yes. friends. Oh, We've been Jerry's around. one of our favorites too. <laughs> Most definitely. <laughs> We're some of the experienced yes. people here that have been coming to the show for a quite a long time. So I'm gonna let them introduce themselves because they're amazing and amazing backgrounds and some really good products that I know you are going to love to see. So. I'm Toby and I'm one of the Milky's moms. I'm a firefighter paramedic for about 17 years now and pumping was a big deal for me to be able to give my breast milk to my daughter because I had to pump in the back of the engine, the back of the rescue with an extreme pumper. I'm an extreme pumper, <laughs> an extreme pumper. Uh, pumping on the way uh -huh. to the fire. Yes, um, that was the only way I was able to give breast milk to my daughter and I found that you know storage was definitely something that was a challenge for my situation and I was able to come up with a better product to fix that. She sure did. Absolutely. Okay, so my name's Helen Anderson. I um, am the creator of the Milk Saver, and the Milk Saver cre collects leaky milk from the non-nursing site during the breastfeeding session. And the reason I came up with the Milk Saver was because I was working in a busy ER. I'm an RN, and 12-hour shifts. 12-hour shifts, <laughs> yeah. exactly. So I have the same kind of problem finding enough time to pump because it just gets busy. There's no like designated break times in an emergency room. Yep. And I realized. After I had my second, I learned from my first that I leaked so much. In mm -hmm. fact, every time I breastfed, I leaked about two ounces. So here I was stressing and stressing about getting enough milk stored for when I was gone at work, and yet I was leaking two ounces every time I breastfed. So, Which can really add up to oh, a lot. Absolutely. I mean, really think about that. That could be almost 10 ounces a day that you just wasted yeah. in a rat. Totally. Easily, easily. easily. So mm -hmm. number one, I was making a lot more laundry for myself by just yeah. leaking yeah. all over everything. Going through a million pads. Right, that's what I need yes. is more laundry. Yes. Having and, to buy pads, yeah. expensive, it really add up. Totally. So what I found was I needed to collect that milk and it simplified my life in so many ways. I had enough milk stored that my husband was able to exclusively feed breast milk while I was gone at work. And then I talked to a lot of other moms and they said, I have the same problem and I would love something that would help me collect my milk and so I created the Milk Saver. That's I the see abridged that version. Lindsay, the Milk Saver was a life saver for her. That's yeah. awesome. Yay, Can we Lindsay, get hard? Tears to my eyes. Hard, yeah. I see, just, you guys are making oh, their I'll day. i there with you. Thank you. <laughs> that's what we're all about is wanting to help all of you moms actually achieve whatever breastfeeding goals that you want to, be it pumping, be it leaking and collecting, yes. just whatever your dreams and goals are, we want to do that for you. Awesome. Let's show it to them because some of you guys have the product, as Lindsay's saying here, it was a lifesaver for her um, and then other of you some of you have never seen it before and you need to see this because you asked for something that's affordable something that's simple something that's gonna help you um, take care of yourself and help you to breastfeed and these are perfect products for that so can we show them yes, let's let's show do that. That. okay and um, let's see let's start with the milk saver yeah, okay gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna turn the screen around Ooh. so you can see okay uh, she oh Lindsay's saying she gives this as a gift to all of her friends oh that's yeah. so great awesome. Are we ready? okay yeah let's do this okay. I'm gonna come around here okay so this is the milk saver and you can see it has a hole here and this is where your nipple goes and then your milk drips into the reservoir here so this is going to just fit right into your bra or a snug tank top if you have one of the shelf bras and anything that gives it a good seal here is going to be acceptable for holding it in place once you have collected enough milk with the milk saver and you're ready to switch sides you stand it up here in the case and then you're ready to do what you need to do and then you just pour the milk out into any container. One thing that I really like to talk to moms about is using breast compression when they have the milk saver in place. Because the milk saver's here, my baby's breastfeeding over here, and then I'm gonna use my hand then in a C shape to compress my breast starting back here by my rib cage and move that milk out of the breast and into the milk saver. Mm -hmm. In this way, number one, I collect more milk. Number two, I get more of the fattier milk that's in the back of the breast. When we collect passively dripping milk, that's great milk, but sometimes the fat content is a little lower. So if you're exclusively using a milk saver to collect, it's good to get some of the fattier milk 
and we also know that an empty breast is a breast that's getting the message to make more milk. So the more we can keep that milk flowing out of the breast, the better your milk supply is going to be. Ah, awesome, yeah. awesome. What, a, what an amazing product. You know, I think that so many moms don't think that they're, you know, they don't realize that there are solutions to some of the issues. Like, you know, I'm leaking on one side, I'm losing so much milk, which is a lot of milk over the day. What are you going to do? Squeeze out the pad? Yeah, right. <laughs> you can't do that. Um, so this is a fantastic thing. And I also love how well thought out it is too, like how it has a little stand. So it makes it easy to go ahead and transfer Switch that sides. into a storage container or a milk tray. Right. <laughs> well, other, great lead in. Great you see that? Efficient. Efficient. That was segue. a great, great segue <laughs> to the so next we're product. Around. Okay, yes. let's do this. Oh my okay. gosh. Okay. <laughs> go so for like it. Said, I'm a firefighter paramedic. I work 24 hour shifts. So pumping was my life to be able to give breast milk to my daughter. But the storage is where I found a big problem. The biggest problem with the bags is you always thaw more ounces than you need at the end of the day. So now you're wasting milk. You're just throwing that away. And as you're pumping, we all know, at least if you're pumping, I did, I found out that pumping is, is a struggle and it's definitely a challenge. So we don't want them to waste any of that liquid gold. Mm -hmm. So what I did was I came up with a tray that helps you to freeze breast milk in single ounce servings, eliminating that waste. Moms are gonna pump into whatever bottle, comes with whatever breast pump, so your choice is available for you. They're gonna pour into the tray. Each cavity is exactly an ounce. It freezes into a one ounce milk stick that can go into a wide mouth, a narrow, and a bent neck bottle. That way then when dads or grandma go to make a bottle, they only thaw the ounces needed for that bottle. Now you talked about savings for moms. Mm -hmm. The milk tray is definitely gonna be a savings. Moms are going to pump into and freeze into the trays, pop out, store long-term in a freezer-safe Ziploc bag, wash, reuse the trays. Mm. So you don't have to keep buying boxes no of No waste. Bags. There's no waste. There's no waste, yep. and you don't have to spend money constantly. And another great thing is that you can use it to make homemade baby food. Oh, I love that. So just a lot of uses for the trays. And Fantastic. my goal is that I hope that all moms can reach whatever breastfeeding goals they want to do. And I don't want going back to work to be that struggle and that challenge. Yeah. No, this is such a great thing. And I'll tell you, one of the things that is always a challenge, especially when we're freezing milk, especially in bags um, is the idea that it two things one is that you may be defrosting a lot more than what you actually need to be feeding the baby most definitely that's and the biggest problem that, that is the biggest problem and so instead of having to freeze different size bags and keep track of the dates and when did I do the last one um, and not defrosting where then you have to use it within the next 24 hours which may not be what you need, um, you never want to miss one drop of liquid gold right. and dump Ever. it. Okay, so Ever. this is just a great solution to be able to, like, like you were saying, just de defrost one ounce at a time. Mm -hmm. Baby eats, and then maybe a little bit hungrier. Take out one more ounce, defrost it, and you're good to go. Right. I mean, if they need three ounces, mm -hmm. they just put the three sticks in. They yeah. Thaw and serve. But sometimes babies are different when they want to eat. Absolutely. They want to eat another ounce instead of a three ounce bag. Absolutely. Just thaw another ounce. Another thing is that the bags tend to, when you're thawing in the bags, yes. there's that residue that's actually a fat residue and you're losing long strand proteins. This way you're thawing in the bottle and there's nothing left behind. Yep. And I think the great thing about the milk saver also is that you have the ability when you're going back to work. If I'm just passively collecting breast milk, I am already relaxed and I think the pumping is not such a stressful situation because I know I've got about 10 ounces already collected yep. just with breastfeeding absolutely so can we get some hearts for this i mean come on these guys made two like such unique innovative and useful products for moms that make your life easier that help to support you with breastfeeding we want to see some hearts um for these two amazing uh people here there we go there's the hearts and more moms hearts just for like sherry you. oh my gosh amazing <laughs> sherry has been talking to moms about breastfeeding yes, for so many years for it's truly her passion and I'm so glad that all of you are following her because you're getting great information. Yes. Aww. And she's out here sharing, you know, really the stuff that you guys need. Oh, you're making me blush. 
Yeah. It's gonna help you guys do what you need to do, which is yes. reach the end. We want everyone to reach their breastfeeding goals, whatever they may be. Yeah, yes. lots of support here for you guys. Lots of support. Would you guys do a little giveaway? One yes, day? Yes. yes. Okay. How about so let's do a giveaway of a milk saver and a milk tray. Perfect. Okay. So what we'll do is we'll do a giveaway. All you have to do is lo love this post. Okay. I want loves. <laughs> you could do likes, but we really like love. So love this post, and then give us a little comment here. Make sure you're commenting. Um, make sure that you're tagging some friends so that you can share this really good information. Tag someone to come watch, and then um, leave a comment. Let us know your situation. Like, why do you need it? What do you love about it? Um, what What did you learn from from looking at this and saying, "Oh my God, this was something that I've been struggling with, and this is going to solve it." So just leave a little comment, and we will be picking a winner. Thank you guys so much. It's so good to be and with I you. And I saw that someone wanted to know where can they get these. Oh, they good. can go to mymilkies.com and you can see both of our products. We have some demonstration videos also. You might see me up on the screen. Yes. It's a little bit longer. <laughs> <laughs> we all look a little different. We do. Maybe a little, maybe a little younger. I'm not sure. Um, you know, um, but yes, definitely that there. And if you guys ever have questions, you know, my Milkies and Milkies Moms, we're out here to help you guys. Fantastic. Yeah. I'm sure we'll be seeing a lot more of you guys. So Thanks, Sherry. Stay tuned. Leave your comment and love the post. I'm coming back because you guys asked for some new stuff and I'm on my way. So stay by your phone, watch for the notifications, and I'll be right back, okay? Love you guys. Bye.